Hello guys, what up? This is Dr. Olive Alex and today's tutorial is how to replace your sky with a Milky Way shot just like Sam called the video and it's pretty easy. So first of all, you want to make sure that your camera shouldn't move around when you're recording your subjects or your scene. So meaning your camera should be on a tripod or on a table or on a grass or any place stable enough for your camera safe enough for a camera to place on and your camera shouldn't move but in this case my video my footage here is actually moving around a little bit side to side but the camera itself is stable this is because the camera is got uh, a gimbal which is they got a motor on the H X and Y and Z axis so it looks stable now like I said if if you don't have a gimbal then it's better put on a tripod I think it would be much more better if this video here was shot on a tripod now since you know about it uh, the, when you want to replace the sky always make sure a camera shouldn't move second is to make sure your footage is really contrasty which is the sky is bright the tree the building is kind of dark which is it's really obvious this is bright this is dark now if you have your sky is kind of blue the building is kind of the same with the sky instead of using luma key you're using a color key it's, it's kind of the same thing but luma key brought dissolve any bright part or dark part but color key dissolve a color based on the color that you pick up on your footage now but it's always worked the best with luma key so when you already throw in your luma key into the into your video that you want to dissolve which is this video here I already added in here on the video so when I turn it on something happened because I already set the threshold all the way to 400 and you want to make sure your key type is brighter of course you want to dissolve the bright part and then you want to bring it down slightly a bit until the sky is kind of fade out so I think it will really look better on this number here now usually people make it like this and then they just render and leave it at this and that would just look horrible so when you already resolve the sky and then there's a Milky Way appear in the sky what will you think about on that moment of course the surrounding should be dark it was a night scene so you can fix that by adding another effects on your video which is color curve you add that in and you want to bring it this down as well this one here going in to the right slightly bit and now you are pretty much done but uh, since there's some holes which is the building also dissolved with the skies because the building got some bright part too you can actually cover up those holes by duplicating the track now like I said earlier it will look much more better if your camera doesn't move around but in this case I'm using a gimbal and I do move around slightly a bit side to side so it will take a much more work because you will need to um, keyframe the mass based on the movement of your camera now if your camera in the fixed position you just mask it out once you just dissolve the sky at once and you're done when everything's moved then you should basically uh, keyframe every single um, movement of the masking and let's just make things complicated and tough so when you already duplicate your layer here you want to go in the middle section here go to the pen and crop turn on the mask and use this pen tool and mask out some parts that you don't want it to be dissolved in this case this part here and there you go and then you want to delete the first key here in the front now when you look at it nothing happened then you, you uncheck the luma key now you can see the building is now completely back to its 
original look you can see some part of the building is masked out that's why it will be look better if your camera doesn't move around so when it's moving then you if you go to the little bit side and then you need to move the mask slightly to the right which is you are basically make a keyframe that will just take forever so that's how you replace the sky and look it like original look like real so hope you guys like my tutorial video and if you have any question or request you can just leave it down on the comment section don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification to get notified on my next video so see you guys on my next video